We've got an FCS FBS showdown between Norfolk State and Temple. He could throw two, but I'm looking forward to see how he leads this team and see how this kid plays and how he goes in and really picks all year for Temple. And Martin gets a chance to bring this one back from the two. Looking for a seam, he bumps off a man and he is down at the 21. And I call up front, so that's been an issue as well. Smith moves the sticks with a gain of about four. Let's take a look at our players to watch. It's third and six. Warner's pressured again, takes a shot downfield for Zay Baines, and he brings it in along the sideline. Absorbed a blow and drops. Let's play action. Warner down the seam, right on target for a first down completion out over. So now second and ten. Warner brings it back to Jaquez Smith. He's got it inside the five, diving. Jaquez Smith's first career receiving touchdown. Caps off the drive with a strike to Jaquez Smith. Temple seven. Norfolk State will get the ball next. 79 yards on the first drive of this game in 323. Camden Price adds the point after, and that's the start. You stopped six of 10 third downs this year at 40%. Pressure coming on Coons, gets rid of it and completes, but a big open. Bunch of green grass in front of him. To the top spot. Smith gets his fourth carry of this first quarter and turns the corner with speed. Kept on going, he does not go down. This time a pitch to Jaquez Smith. All kinds of space in front, first down, Owls. Smith is inside the 30. Right back to Jaquez Smith. The C parts in front, and he has his third consecutive first down. 12 more yards for Jaquez Smith. On second down, pitch to Edward Sadie running to that right side, and ball may have come out at the end. It's down on the turf. Albert in motion for Norfolk State. Otto Coons looking to throw, slings it out for Talbert, and finds him out over the 15, where he is hit hard out of bounds at the 16 yard. Warner on play action, gets it out quick, finds Ahmad Anderson. Oh, look at that nifty little cut over the first down line and out to the fourth. And it comes to Hubbard out of the backfield. First down and more. He makes a man miss. And Darvon Hubbard inside the 30, inside the 20. 35 yards on fourth down. Now Temple's going to go hurry up. Hubbard gets the carry and keeps his feet. Darvon Hubbard whirling toward the end zone and down to the one. He put him in in running situations. They're running the Hurts push and Temple scores. I hate to say it, they call it the tush push. They tried to change the ruling up in the NFL. Norfolk State may have found a way to stop it with that really good over the top play by AJ. And Price drills this one right down the middle. 14 nothing. Tens back in it running back on first down. Evans has a seam, and there he goes up the middle. Biggest play of this game for the Spartans as Evans gains down. It's third and eight here. Pressure coming late. Coons gets it out and completes for a first down. Slung it out of the backfield. And it's the second and 12. Coons quick out. And that is swallowed up by Taiwan Francis after Gregory on third and two. Coons keeps it himself, lowers the shoulder. He lost the football, but recovers it himself. And it's a first down. game for the Spartans. Xavion Evans with good blocking on the outside. Gets to the corner, and he's shoved down at the five. Taiwan on third down. Coons looking to throw. Has time, steps up, hit as he throws, end zone, touchdown! Aaron Moore brings it in. Coons just shows all the moxie you want. He steps up in the pocket and delivers a very catchable ball. This is what you call, you know, I, I said at the beginning of the broadcast. And he sticks it through. How about 13 plays, 82 yards. First down, handoff goes to Jaquez Smith. Huge hole once again, and Jaquez Smith keeps on moving the legs up to the... Just push your guy back. Right back to Smith, bounces to the outside, makes a man miss, and dances ahead toward the 50, give him six more. Smith with his seam up front, accelerates through, and he is gone. Jaquez Smith, house call, touchdown, 51 yards. Great play by the freshman. Came off the ball 
and he just uh, ran it to pay dirt. Well, that's a play of first there with that carry. It's his first career minutes left in the first half. Camden Price on the point after it is 21-7 Owls. Play action. Warner has time. Has an open receiver and hits on the outside. Oh, stumbling down the sideline. Warner pressured from behind, gets rid of it, and it's pulled in for a first down. Tight along the sideline, Dante right. Fourth quarter, that's why fourth quarter, you know, things started going awry for him. Here's Darvon Hubbard bouncing to the outside and rolling into the end zone. Touchdown. Touchdown. Great, great play, great finish. Season's a tempo. Get the big offensive line out on the stretch play. Price's point after puts Temple ahead by a full three scores, 28 to seven. As the out play action on third and nine, Coons heaving one over the middle and he finds more again. They hooked up for a touchdown. Play action, slinging out to Andre Pegues and he's got it inside of Jalen McMurray for another first down and nine more of the game. Only missed two plays. Jalen White at running back. He makes a man miss and stutter steps for a first down game of 12. Second and 10 from the 11. Coons underneath open receiver Elijah Mitchell and he gains two. Gets out of bounds. Pressure coming. Warner dumps it underneath. First down and more. Ahmad Anderson Jr. out over the ski today at this Temple foot. A lot of time running off the clock. Warner going to need to get this one downfield. He finds the open receiver into field. Drill gets free, gains about 15 more yards. Pocket holds for Warner. He takes a shot at the end zone. Oh, nearly intercepted and incomplete. Kuhn steps up. Looking to run for it. He's pushed out of bounds. Couldn't get away from uh, in the conference. Warner goes to the air, takes a shot down the sideline. Ahmad Anderson brings it in. E.J. Warner. First down, handoff goes to Darvon Hubbard. He has the corner again. Hubbard surging inside the 30 and down to the 23. 21 more yards. Wide receiving core right now, so they've been looking for other options. Warner coming underneath to Anderson. He's immediately hit and dropped shy of the marker to set up fourth down in front. And this is perfect. Camden Price right down the chute. And Temple gets three out of it. What's best moving forward? Coons over the middle, and there are those drops again. It was a bit out in front of Andre Pegues, but one he could have brought in. A bit here in the second half. Sadie trying to break through. He gets past the first line and moves the legs to gain about five more yards. Gives the handoff to Reese Clark on the around the edge and he gains only three of the needed four so it does set up a fourth down play action on third and three Warner taking a shot for the end zone incomplete hung up there a bit as he was trying to find Dunt right for it no he throws and he hits David Martin Robinson for a first down probably could have gotten him with his legs but flicked it ahead to the tight end four-man rush for Norfolk State Warner underneath finds Ahmad Anderson looking to shake and bake and he gets down to the two. Patterson keeps it. He's hit once. He falls forward and gets in. Touchdown, Tempton. Big guy. One step. Goes inside. Great play. The tip of the ball just has to break the mark. And Price knocks it through again. Some perfect on point after today. He's added a field goal as well. You know, he's a gamer. A tough kid, takes hits, keeps on coming. He dumps a screen pass underneath. And Lex Henry has plenty of room in front. There is a flag from Warren before they start giving you the proven results. Coons on play action. Slings a good one over the middle to Tavion Morris for a first down. They're on defense, so we'll keep our eye on that as Henry gets a block from Otto Coons. Flag is down as Coons was leading the way. And Lex Henry ran. A chance for the Owl defense. Coons escapes, needs the 20, and he gets there. Otto Coons is still going inside the 10, and he is down to the 6. Effort from Otto Coons against 20. But I tell you about a tough guy. 
I mean, <laughs> he is going to go out there. He's going to be cruising for a bruise. And on his way home, <laughs> one wraps up. Well, that's uh, 15 minutes of game time away. What? Coons looking to throw on second down to the running back, Evans. He's cut down shy of the goal line. Good, hard. Coons play action, looking to throw to the end zone. It's broken up. DJ Woodbury got his hand. Bad block by the running back. Didn't give you guys a I mean, drive in the second quarter, but otherwise pretty solid game defensively as well. Huge solid game, you know, but this, you know, we're, we're talking about a team that had higher aspirations to go as well. Back to King on the ground with a new lease on life after the first down. He gains four before Will Coxon brings him down. I mean, he got a targeting call in the second half against Rutgers last week, so could not play in the first half. Getting some run time now as Norfolk State picks up another first down. With uh, you know, and and what I mean by his guys, his first year he came here, got hired in May. It was a whole new recruit class. Georgia. Quincy Patterson, a first down give, and E.J. Wilson churning legs, so he makes up for that 38 and a touchdown. Keep it on the ground, Patterson himself lowers the shoulder and booms ahead. He has the first down, needed eight. The quarterback, they believe in his skill set. He's still. Here's Wilson with a big hole. E.J. Wilson inside the 20, down to the 17, he gains nine. To put Temple over the 40-point mark. Price is true. 41 next week. Oh, the snap on third down over the top of Lee. And Lennon dives on top of it, and that'll likely be the last play of this game. The past two games. Well, they had some consistency in this game, and this will kind of springboard them into next week against Miami. Yeah, that's a three in this game. 532 yards of offense for Temple. Remember, they gained 300.